All right, it was hot today. Our own Nate Rogers walked the streets of the city to find out how you were dealing with it. Bill, if you were out and about Friday, you couldn't help but to continue wiping streams of sweat from your face. I definitely kept my sweat rag handy. Big boy got moves. Let's go. A trio of subway dancers kept New Yorkers and tourists entertained on the E-Train Friday. If you were lucky enough to stay in air-conditioned spaces, today was good, but bracing the heat outside required a nice, cool icy. It's too hot, that's why I'm out here, just to eat the icy, just to stay cool and enjoy the nice weather. Here in West Harlem, the flavored ice stand got all of the business as an estimated 3 million people are visiting New York for various events, including World Pride. Oh, it's beautiful. People are out here. The sun is out. Skin glistening. It's, it's a great day. It has to be at least 98 degrees right now. <laughs> what is that like for you? I mean, are you hot? You sweating? I am, but coming from Chicago, this is a nice change, man. Well, it's real nice. Expect the subway to be packed and streets more congested than ever. Number one reminder, stay hydrated. Stay hydrated, drink plenty of water, a lot of water is what you need. Ice water, but water. Mm. No and sodas. And just trying to stay out of the sun, right? Stay out of the sun as much as possible. And finally, Bill, on Sunday, you can definitely expect to see trains and the entire village area on lockdown, overflowing with people because of the Pride Walk that's taking place. A list of street closures is on my Twitter page at Nate Wants to Know. In Manhattan, I'm Nate Rogers for Chasing News.